Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you. What? It? it it's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us. He doesn't speak much English. Yeah, no shit. Is that it? I thought you said it was a house. Arvo, is this where the supplies are? Where the food is? Answer her, goddammit! No, it's at the house. There's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. Luke needs a break. We probably all do. Look, I'll do whatever you guys want, okay? But I could use the rest. It'd be safer to rest in there, where there's a fence. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. Wouldn't have guessed that it worked. Me neither. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. Here, take it. It ain't an it, it's a he. And he has a name. Ain't that right, Alvy? Oh, such a handsome boy. Come on over. It's safe. <sighs> Today's my birthday. Near as I can tell, at least. Definitely this week. Well, happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. So, how old are you now? I am 27 years old. That's pretty old. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. Probably. I'd have liked to go to college. What did you study? Majored in art history. Well, that's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion. Yeah. All it being your birthday and all. Figure. This is as good a time as any. I'd like a sip. I mean, after you, obviously. Really? No. Oh, what's a sip gonna hurt? You are not drinking. That is that. I feel a little guilty taking the first. Whoa, time. wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, 
I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. Can't be too careful. The baby might be cold. Nah, I'll keep him warm. He's a tough little guy. You sure? Yeah. Come on, Kenny. Just sit a little while longer. Nah, you stay warm. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises me. It's a good thing. You saved her. I know. I know. I just don't know what she's getting out of this. We're lucky to have her. I'm glad she's here. Will she help us back there? So that puts her as okay in my book. How you feel about her? Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. All right. All right. It wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said neither. It's my fault for bringing it up. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes. That, that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. The both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. I don't know. Maybe she likes him? No, I think we could bet on that. As you see here, Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the legs. Worked on me. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry, it's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thought. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jade and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change the At least we don't need to worry about being electrocuted. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Probably been a while for everyone. We just want you to feel welcome. It's warm over by the fire. What is it? It's rum. Does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? That's really good. Have you had any? You want to sit? It's okay. It just might burn a little. You'll feel it in your nose. Um, sure. 
<laughs> you okay? It's not as bad as the moonshine stuff I had with Nick. Whoa. Yeah, that stuff was like fire. Uh-oh, busted. I better take that back. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? I was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals. And I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. And I proceeded to eat what I thought was sugar candy. It was not sugar candy. Did you ever get caught? Yeah. The problem with glasses, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. Got grounded for six months. You ate glass? I ate glass. I haven't thought about that in a long time. A deal's a deal. Here. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. Time to not make it weird. Wanna sit here? No. That's... I'm fine. Oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. So, how far is the house? We walked all day, so I assume we're pretty close. Leave me alone, please. This TV feels like forever since we had electricity. There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. I asked you not to drink. I'm so, so sorry. You, you really hurt my feelings. I did. 
did my best and... I know. I was just in darkness. And you showed up with some light. And I thought I needed to stay there a little longer. When I should have went with you. Okay. Just get this stuff out and open. Let's drop it. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. Shh. All right, enough of that. Hey, Clem. It's nice to hear people laughing. Yeah, it is. You just spend so much time trying to stay alive. You don't get a chance to enjoy. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Take first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really? I, uh... Don't mention it. 